Hello everyone, in this video we're going to talk about probability of mutually exclusive events. So when we say mutually exclusive events, these are events that cannot occur or occur at, uh, happen at the same time. So hindi pwedeng magsabay yung event. Uh, halimbawa, item number 1, a bowl contains 15 chips numbered 1 to 15. If a chip is drawn randomly from the bowl, what is the probability that it is a 7 or a 15. So, dito, ang, ang event natin ay drawing a chip so from a bowl. Pero, dalawa ang kailangan mo makuha sa isang bunot lang. Okay? So, ang tawag natin dito ay mutually exclusive event kasi hindi mo pwedeng makuha ng sabay yung 7 at saka 15. Dahil isa lang naman ang 7 sa 1 to 15 at isa lang ang 15 sa numbered 1 to 15. So, so we have, as you can see, so we have probability of 7. So, pag kinuha mo ba yung probability ng 7, ilan? So, syempre may isang 7 lang naman sa numbered 1 to 15. Ilang chips? Over 15. So, yan yung probability fraction, decimal, or percentage. Pag kinuha naman yung probability of 15, so ilan bang 15 sa, sa chips? So mayroon ka lang ding isa. Over 15 pa rin. Okay? Now, ang question, find the probability of uh, drawing 7 or 15. So mayroon tayong word na or so, yun yung palatandaan mo para sa mutually exclusive event, yung word na OR. Pag OR ang ginagamit, ang operation mo ay PLUS. Take note ha, ang operation natin dito ay PLUS. So, probability of uh, 7 or 15. So, sa ibang book, ito ay 7 union of 15. So, ayan. Ganyan po yung symbol natin na ginagamit. Pwedeng 7, uh, probability of 7 or 15, or probability of 7 union 15. So, that is yung symbol sa math. So, ang operation natin is plus. Ano ba ang probability ng 7? So, that is 1 over 15. Plus. O, yung word na or. Probability of 15, 1 over 15. So, syempre, we have common denominator. <coughs> uh, 1 plus 1, we have 2. So, copy the denominator of 15. So, definitely, yung 2 at saka 15 ay hindi na natin pwedeng simplify. So, therefore, the final answer is 2 over 15. So, let us have item number 2. A bag contains 6 yellow jerseys, numbered 1 to 6. The, va uh, the bag also contains 4 purple jerseys numbered 1 to 4. You randomly pick a jersey. Find the probability that you will pick a purple jersey or a jersey that has a number greater than 4. So, dalawa ulit ang hinihingi. So, meron tayong word na or dyan. So, uh, ang tanong, pwede ba, may common ba sila? So, yung set A natin, purple jersey. Ang purple jersey natin, may numbered lang na 1, 2, 4. Okay? Tapos, yung isa, ang inihingi, greater than 4. So, may common kaya? So, wala. So, therefore, this is mutually exclusive event. So, yung dalawang event natin ay hindi pwedeng magsabay. Sa so, isang kuhaan lang. So, that is mutually exclusive. So, unahin natin muna yung probability ng purple. Okay? Ang probability ng purple, syempre, nakalagay doon, purple jersey numbered 1 to 4. So, we have 4 over ilan ba lahat ng jersey? So, we have 10. Okay? We have 10. Yung 6 yellow at saka 4 purple. So, meron kang 10 na jersey. So, ito, pwedeng maging 4 over 10 or 2 over 5. 
Now, how about <clears throat> number uh, jersey that has a number greater than 4? So, probability nung number greater than 4. So, yung number daw na greater than 4. So, ilan ba ang greater than 4? So, syempre, meron kang 5 at saka 6. Ito. So, sa so 1 to 6, meron syempre, yung greater than 4 ay 5 and 6. So, meron kang 2 out of 10. So, that is 1 fifth. Okay? So, ngayon, ang hinihingi kasi ay yung kanilang probability na magkasama. So, pwede kayang mag, uh, find the probability that you will pick a purple jersey or a jersey that has a number greater than 4. So, ilalagay mo, probability of purple or number greater than 4. So, pwede siyang union. <clears throat> okay? Purple or number greater than 4. Okay? So, that is equal to, ano yung probability ng purple? We have 2 over 5 plus greater than 4, we have 1 over 5. So, 2 plus 1, 3. Copy the denominator na 5. So, the final answer is 3 over 5. So, let us have additional example. So, we have a basket contains 3 apples, 3 peaches, and 4 pears. You randomly select a piece of fruit. So, isang piraso ang kinuha mo sa basket. Find the probability that it is an apple or a peach. <coughs> so, isa-isain muna. Ano ba yung probability ng apple? So, let us have A na lang sa apple. Okay? So, yung apple natin, syempre, uh, ilan ba yung apples? We have 3. Over, ilan lahat ng fruit sa basket? So, 3 plus 3, so we have 6 plus 4, we have 10. So, ang probability na makuha mo si apple sa basket is 3 out of 10. Okay? Next, probability ng peach. Okay? So, we have, <clears throat> ilan ba yung peach? So, we have also 3. Sa basket, ilan lahat? We have 10. So, therefore, ang ating uh, probability na makuha si apple or peach, so, ang gagawin mo lang, syempre, or kasi ang word, so, ang operation mo is addition. So, probability of apple or peach. So, that is equal to 3 over 10. So, ito yon probability ng apple plus probability ng pitch 3 over 10 so same denominator so add lang natin yung numerator so 6 copy the denominator of 10 so 6 over 10 pwede natin i-simplify yan so or divide natin sa 2 so maging 3 over 5 